guys, oh my gosh, I'm so excited to tell you about my first NHL experience. I oh, I can't believe it. It was so, so much fun, you guys. I tried to record as much as I could. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. It's so busy. But it was kind of difficult to film because the seats are quite close together and the person behind you was like right there. So I couldn't really like film a lot. But um, I tried to film as much as I could. Oh my gosh, you guys, I just had the best time ever. It just totally exceeded my expectations. Like it was just so much fun. I've always said no one does sport events better than the USA. <laughs> have so much fun at sports events in America anyways so I want to tell you about like how it happened and things like that just because I didn't get enough footage to put into one video so I thought like I'll tell you about my experience you know and I guess past tense so it was um the Chicago Blackhawks game versus Tampa Bay Lightning uh at the United Center in Chicago so we Ubered to the center. That was all good. It was very well organized, a little Uber section. There was an individual, like, a huge tent thing that was heated inside. Look, we're blue. I'm a blue guy. Everybody look blue. <laughs> What's mad? Everybody look blue. We're heading to my first ever NHL game guys. I'm so excited. I can't even explain. So I guess after the game everybody could go there to wait for their Ubers. So so smart. So very organized. I was very very impressed. But anyway so I messed up you guys. So obviously I've never been to an NHL game before and I messed up. I didn't know you couldn't bring backpacks into the venue. I was like, oh no, we saw it on the sign. I was like, oh no, I've got a backpack. Oh no. So, you know, I tried to go into with my backpack because, you know, worth a shot, you know, but nope, they were not having it. But they were really, really nice. Like, he was so nice. He was like, oh, excuse me, like, you can't bring that in here. I was like, oh no, like, we Ubered here. Like, oh no, you know, what am I going to do with my bag? Am I going to go stash in a bush or something? Like, what am I going to do? But then he was super, super nice and he was like, oh, that's okay. Like, we have a, um, like, a baggage, like, drop off area, like, trailer thing that you can go to. And he told us where to go. So, yeah, we. Uh, walked a lot. We walked to the trailer thing. We actually got a little bit lost, but um, somebody else helped us out. And um, my bag was like pretty big. It was like pretty like this big. Um, but I also saw other people. I guess it was like the husbands or the boyfriends or something. They were like walking like this towards the trailer, like like oh. Then they were holding like these teensy little backpacks, and I think they were going like they were their girlfriends or. A wives bag or something they look so mad but they were like walking to this trailer to go check in this little tiny little backpack so i was like yeah you know what if those tiny little backpacks aren't allowed then i definitely wouldn't be able to bring my huge backpack in but anyway so we went to the trailer and it was so all good like yes, the i thought it would be really busy but super organized like i'm just so impressed just so organized Literally, New Zealand could never <laughs> be this organized. If you go to a, you know, a sports game in New Zealand or any kind of event, it, in my opinion, it tends to be a little bit disorganized and no one really knows what they're doing, not even the workers. So um, I just appreciate well-organized events and situations like that. So yeah, anyways, so we checked in our bag and they gave us a ticket. So I was like, okay, cool, sweet, let's go, let's go. And uh, yeah, we entered, oh my gosh. And as soon as I entered, it just felt like, oh my gosh, this is a party. This is a party. Oh yeah, it's fine. I need to as well. It was so busy, like so lively. We've got the stalls, people selling drinks, selling food, all sorts of things. I was so excited. Yeah, I saw that. 
there was a DJ in there I was like what the heck this is awesome so we um yeah walked in we went to the bathroom <laughs> walked upstairs and then it was so crazy because this is the first time i've ever seen this in real life it was one of those amazon like um no register stores oh amazon So you put in your card and then you walk in and you grab what you want and you just walk out and somehow it calculates the total. I have no idea how it works, but it did. But I ended up getting an IPA. Got my drink. Got IPA. I don't know what this is, but it says India. India Pale Ale. I like Pale Ale, so hopefully it's good, but I don't really know what to get. See how it goes. I'm so excited. I can't even explain. We're on an escalator right now, so... We're gonna go to our seat. And then we went upstairs to get seated and as soon as I walked out into like the the area, you know, like I guess the circle part, I don't know, when you walk out into and you see the ice rink, whatever, I was just like, oh, this is amazing. We're here, I'm so excited, this is crazy. This is crazy, oh my gosh. Like this is just everything I imagined. Like I'm just so excited. I was so so excited. We were like kind of in the nosebleed seats, but not super super nosebleed, but pretty nosebleed. You can probably see where where roundabout we were sitting. I guess from my footage, but um, we got a pretty good deal on them. I actually got them off SeatGeek. I don't know if you guys have used SeatGeek before, but it was a lot cheaper on SeatGeek, like a lot cheaper. And I had a twenty dollar voucher. Like a first time customer voucher on SeatGeek. So I was like, oh, this is awesome. Like, get that. Uh, anyways, that's besides the point. <laughs> but I walked in and we got sat down. And I was just like, this is amazing. <laughs> the sound effects the vibe the you know people were so excited like oh it was so cool and um oh with the air horn uh, i was so excited like i couldn't even contain myself guys i was so excited and then um yeah they started calling out like the players on the big screen like this is who's playing whatever um, I wasn't super familiar with any of the players. I was just there for a good time, <laughs> you know. Um, and then they came out and then we did the national anthem. And it was really, really nice. And um, and then I guess the game started after that. Yeah, the game started and I felt like the nosebleeds aren't too bad because you can kind of see everything on the ice rink from kind of like a bird's eye view, I guess. <laughs> So I really enjoyed the seats. I forgot my glasses though, but it didn't seem to be an issue. I could still see pretty fine. Um, and Chicago scored first. Was pretty exciting but the score ended up being 4-1 to Tampa Bay so that wasn't so good for the home team in Chicago but um oh oh my gosh guys let me let me tell you something so they had a um like a selfie cam so you could like scan the barcode and then like film yourself and then possibly they'll put you up on the big screen and guess what <laughs> we were put up on the big screen let me show you it <laughs> uh, we were put up on the big screen. We couldn't believe it. We're like, oh my gosh. We're like waving like this. 
Oh, it was so, so funny. But yeah, the skill also, the skill of the players was just insane. Like, I, I still don't understand how they play this game, especially to the skill level that they do. Like, it's just insane in the membrane for realsies. <laughs> Also the the um the goalie is so impressive. I'm just like, how do you, how do like just how <laughs> like the puck moves so quickly? So that was so so impressive. It was just so cool to be there in real life. You know, you know, if I lived in a city like Chicago or any city in the USA where they had lots of sports games, dude, I would be getting season passes. I'd be going to the venue every single week. Oh my gosh it would be so much fun like it's such a fun thing to do like it's just fun well i guess i can say that because i really like sport i guess for other people it's not so fun if you don't like sport but i just love sport so this is like this is heaven for me to go to such exciting sports games <laughs> just puts on a great show in sport like they really really do and I'm just never ever ever disappointed <laughs> been to a couple of baseball games before and yeah it was the same kind of energy and vibe like it's just so exciting oh my gosh I wish that I could go to these games every like I said like every single week but you know it's a long <laughs> it's a long flight from New Zealand but yeah then the game ended and um Chicago lost obviously so that was disappointing it was like meh, meh. <laughs> <laughs> But then we left out and then we um, got our bags and, well, got my bag from the trailer and then we went home. <laughs> it was overall such an amazing experience. So well organized. I was just so impressed with everything. It was so fun for my first ever NHL experience. So we are now outside. This is in the United Center, so it's not too cold, I feel. There was nothing that really, there was, actually, it was nothing at all that disappointed me. Um, at first, I was like, oh, no, like, we can't bring our backpacks in. But then at the end of the day, it actually makes sense. And I'm actually like, okay, that's a good thing that you can't bring backpacks in. And I feel like most people already know that. I think just because I've never been to an NHL game before, I just didn't know. But now I do, you know, so... Um, I think it's a good idea. So people just know not to bring their bags in, you know, so It's a two thumbs up from me so much fun. I hope to go to another one very very soon. Well as soon as possible, but It might not be for a while, but I'll definitely be going again. So so much fun um, oh, I hope you guys enjoyed the clips anyways uh, I just really wanted to film this separate video to kind of tell you about my experience. Oh my gosh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm I'm a very like overexcited person, so I just get excited. I'm just getting excited at how excited I was last night. I was just so excited. I was so excited. It was just the best. But yeah, I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, hopefully get some more videos out for you very very soon i love you guys so much and uh hopefully catch you in my next video bye guys Mwah.